Cartersville. This is Cartersville. Some churches you could say are a little hypocritical based off the people. A lot of people will go, if I'm being brutally honest, to make a vision, a look for themselves to look like, you know, I go to church, I'm a, but they won't live by the Word of God. I think this community does a great job of trying to recruit people. Okay. And yeah, around I do here. Too. I do. They'll have different like events and stuff to bring people in. and People here find a home church and that is their home. That is their church. I won't say it's not there, but I do think it's getting fewer and fewer. People are a little bit less outspoken about their faith. First time I'd ever been to church, I didn't feel judged if I wasn't dressed to the nines and all that. But so I've really seen churches become more progressive over the years. Well, there are some churches that they feed and give out groceries and stuff like that. Uh, well, I know there's not a lot of door-to-door -door stuff like that. It's just mostly helping food-wise. And I think it's, it would be a good idea to do that because some people can't get out to go to church. I think most churches are open to anybody coming in. It's just that I just don't do a lot of outside. Right now, I'm not in the church right now, but I believe in God, bro. Yeah? Yeah. I know I believe in my God, so. It's been a while. I don't know. I didn't, you know, be in the church. They all, I mean, they're good. I hadn't had a bad experience in church. And there's, okay. some, there's some real good preachers around here. And this it, in this pandemic, it's, it's been really uh, visible to see. You know, them really getting out and doing part in the community, helping out with outreaches for food and, and different things of that sort. So it's been, you've been, it, it's been more visible now.